Hello dear friends. It's quite... Uh, I'm sorry to let you suffer another makeup video so that I can do a blah 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 and uh, um, question answers. It's been a long time I didn't answer your questions and I feel not, uh, not right. So as much as I can, I will answer them all, and uh, this way we are both done with it. And also, actually, okay, very lightly, that will be sufficient. This is vacation time. I do not need to wear makeup. So, I should cherish this time. Something wrong with my eyes. They know about uh -oh. Fix it. Okay, got it fixed. So, what did I want to say? Hmm. Maybe I should report you. I bought one of these. This is Dark Knight, and I like it. And the good thing is, it's. Do. <laughs> It's a magnetic, and with other things you need to clip in, clip up. Sometimes it's got broken, but this magnetic, it will always be there. I like it. So... And it's dark night color. How about we do this in abstract style, just quick and flash doing it, just roughly doing it. No need to go to too much detail. The other day I do, did a painting, it's a friend sent me a picture of, uh, he did wonderful painting, I did not know this person. It's a YouTube. Uh, it's a fa Facebook friend. He sent me a picture of uh, of his painting. Oh, it's wonderful, wonderful. It's very inspiring, and you see other artists doing something. It's quite inspiring, especially when you are run out of idea. It just gets me started to do it again. And uh, he sent a picture of. Uh, he sent his some of his picture and then he sent a picture of a wave. I was feeling very inspired but very, very, very intimidated. And then I was trying and finally I did it. I was thinking this was the worst one I'm going to get, uh, give up and I was thinking, okay, whatever, let me just be done with it and post it on Facebook. And then I post this picture on Facebook and to my surprise I got more than 60 likes. It's quite surprising. Okay, so we can take a look at this picture. So this is the picture of this. It's this one, and I got more than 60 likes, so quite to my surprise. And it's actually very encouraging to, to, to think that something you think wrong, you think doesn't look good, may not be just that wrong, that not good. So keep an open eye and accept, accept things that you do not like, accept other people, other idea, other things, and also, very, very most importantly, accept yourself. Accept yourself the way it is at such a stage. Well, let me fix a little bit. Accept yourself. Accept what you have done. It may not be good, but once you accept it, 
you have an old new perspective on it and you have a new eye view on it it totally changed now i start to love this picture extract makeup quick and easy and multitasking with blah 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 or and Okay, that's about it. Some <clears throat> blue and some red one. This red one does not show color at first. As you apply, it shows more color. So this video I will keep on with our chat on blah 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 on the <clears throat> question and answer. So one friend asked <clears throat> when I think the question was gee, 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 gee. the question was dear Hain, here's my question do you students know you okay what made you want to start making uh, videos on YouTube and how do you feel about about it after all this time do you enjoy listen to music do you have a favorite composer or performer so we start from the music um, do you like to listen to music i think i like to listen to music i think everybody likes to listen to music it's just the finding the most comfortable and most uh, uh, finding your own taste and um, and uh, I, I really love musicians. I really am very impressed by music, this art form. It brings all the things out of you and bring your... It's heartbroken, heart melting. And listen to music, it just brings all our things out of our life. It's, and I always appreciate those artists. How can they make music that touch right our heart and so strongly profoundly tenderly and in such a, a unique manner and what is my favorite composer i do not know any composer's name maybe not any i do not know most of the composer's name and um, and uh, I do not buy music, I listen to radios on the music and uh, my family has uh, quite a different uh, music taste so it's kind of uh, a torturing for me to listen to other people's music and uh, sometimes it drives me crazy when, when you are doing something and totally not in that particular music mood and you just become... <laughs> you, want to, you want to break up things, you want to kill things you want to you want to you want you just become so frustrated music is is just so powerful when you get it right it soothes our heart it melts our heart and when it is not right it breaks our heart and it's, it's enrage us and uh, all the musicians they are passionate for their own style something we love the most is hated the most by some other people so again, go back to that logic. So, I listen to radio music and I listen to free music. And I used to buy music when I was doing business. I make good money. And now I'm not making that much money. And, and it's just the, 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 the lifestyle change. After you become mom, there's not much you think about yourself. 
or there's not much money, extra money spending on, on those things. Before, as a single girl, you spend money on music, on movie, on other things, and now after become mom, you become married, life is different. It's another world of, it's another, uh, it's another, uh, a new world of life, new life phase. So I used to buy music and uh, I love the music that touch my heart. I do not have, a, I do not know a favorite brand. All the brands I appreciate, all the musicians, my big applaud for big Koto for the for the great musicians, for any musician, no matter they make it big or not making it big, music takes heart to make and touches people's heart. Whatever music you make, you make, you touch your own heart, you touch other people's heart. Could you do a draw? I must be the advanced to having a short. Another one, what made you, okay, let me just do this one. What made you want to start making video on YouTube? So it must be something like 10 years, 19, eight or seven or eight years ago. That was the starting of uh, YouTube period. And uh, I, uh, I was in a Chinese painting group, Yahoo group. And we were exchanging ideas on painting, exchanging ideas on material, on technique. And then there was one person, one group me member, showed a video of YouTube, on YouTube and uh, doing video. And at that time, I, I actually, my very, very first video is a private video. Now it's private. I was learning to try to use it to teach music. That was when my baby was uh, 10 years ago. So I made my video and uploaded it and it worked. It's very fun. And my baby, I was trying to teach Chinese and he was moving around. And, uh, so at this Yahoo group, one friend showed a video of painting. And then I was thinking, I always write down, we always exchange ideas on how to painting, use words. How about a visually showing a video? So I start use my camera to shoot my very first video and it's a low resolution. And I was so shy, so intimidated, I did not even talk. It's something like a one or two minutes video painting a bamboo. And then I show to the group the group people liked it and then uh, slowly I got some other people uh, got some other view from one view to ten views because of the group people and then 20 views or something and then I start to get subscribers <clears throat> one or two subscribers and then ten subscribers and uh, and I was so shocked. I didn't do, it was such a, a lousy video. <laughs> and people start to subscribe. And then I start to do different video, bamboo, and then orchid painting, all Chinese painting, orchid painting, and then uh, uh, chrysanthemum painting. And so my first four painting, I think it's something like Chinese painting. And then I start to make a video introducing Chinese uh, painting materials and things. At that time we were living in, Aust in Australia. And uh, so it made me happy and the people were very friendly at the beginning. And there was no hate comment, there was not much other comments and they say okay it's good it's interesting i want to know something more so i keep on making new videos and uh, the subscriber became 100 or even some more numbers i was so excited at that time i was thinking if i can get 100 number that will be so subscriber will be so good and then over 100 and then up to 800 500 800 1000 oh, 
all those milestones it really makes me happy and as I start to make video there are people uh, I got some notice and uh, there are people um, making uh, critics and uh, there were people making some really uh, critics that breaks my heart it uh, uh, saying something like me like a moron or something it's just a very, you know it's kind of a, a very hate uh, and uh, and some words as uh, as uh, ugly person you are just being silly on the youtube those kind of things and uh, it was very discouraging so i made a video to go against it and i got a lot of comments and people are all stand up to go against those uh, who write hate comments who write by bad comments so just uh, uh, there is up and down and in the downtime i got help i got help from from uh, youtube friends and then it just keep getting uh, positive energy and after that I start to do some cooking video I think cooking video people liked it why not I like to cook like or not I, I cook every day it's a, it's a mom's life you cook every day okay. So I start to do those videos and cooking video and uh, there was one day I was very in low spirit so I did a, I listened to music and uh, did a dance video and people liked it and some singing video and just a nothing video and a family out video and uh, um, at the beginning I do video and then I edit it so it takes time I compose some video and uh, and different uh, clips and compose it together. And then at that time there was an e village, e village, I think it's e, uh, e expert, e expert or uh, expert village. Yes, there was an expert village, and uh, you can sign up and you can make video and propose to them, and uh, you can make money out of it. So. Um, I made some video and sent to Expert Village and then almost sent, I think. And uh, it's very easy you get approved. I think they are hunger for videos. It's very easy you get approved and then I checked the, the Expert Village and it's, it's full of hate comments. It's just so ugly, so dirty. Whatever video even in good intention there are people just to go to there to vent and uh, then i realized i could not even delete or control once i put my video into a, another person's site if i put video on my site i can control you have uh, bad words i can delete that if I, I i i hear something that i do not like i do not feel appropriate i can delete and i can control even my own video but that one you cannot control so i didn't do that finally so i didn't get that much hate comments so just keep on doing and uh, you have friends friends come and go some friends kept up uh, all these years sometimes uh, friends came and then they left and after some times they come back but through youtube i have seen some of the most amazing peoples you are the most amazing people, not because you are expert in one particular field, not because you are successful or something, because you are you. And each person gives me comments and with the particular way of commenting, some comments full of energy, some comments full of rage, some comments full of softness, tenderness, whichever way I just like feel true person it's 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 uh, so it's very encouraging and very fun to to build up such a family and uh, and also um, what else uh, 
now I do not get much hate comments, not people, I think maybe because I do not get very much views. When you get much views, you get more intention and people will, will have critic on you. Gosh, you are doing so bad, how can you get uh, so many views? But I think I'm keeping in the low, uh, not so many people viewing my videos. So only people who like you, who, who can suffer this and who really have a heart with us together, uh, make, uh, make comments and views. So there's no hate comments. It's make it a very positive, positive uh, side, a community getting place. This is what I feel. And... Uh, <clears throat> So this is how I, <coughs> how it all gets started, and um, <coughs> and uh, after these years, how do I feel? I feel making video is one part of my life. It makes me happy. It makes it's one of the channel myself going to the world. And uh, how about if there's no YouTube video? I think I can still survive. Nobody will die because of no video, not making video. It, uh, it's a question of after some time you get used to it. I am still in the trend of making it. I'm still happy to make it. I still enjoy doing it. I still have not exhausted my interest of making videos. So... It will keep on after all this year what I feel. It's a wonderful thing. It's a wonderful thing. This world has provided us so many beautiful things. It depends on how you use it. Facebook, social media, uh, Pinterest, uh, Instagram, all this. It depends how you use it. And the original purpose, the original idea was good and some people abuse it. You will not be the abuser. You will protect yourself from the abusing, and then you can enjoy it. Same as everything else, same as food. Food was invented to make us enjoy. You enjoy too much, you consume too much, it will become a poison for you. Yeah, same thing. Okay, so this is about the YouTube story. And another thing, what else? Uh, how do you meet your husband? Yeah, this one is a private question. Could you do a draw your life? I've been advanced. Short question. I would also like to know what is the appeal of making your own yogurt? Oh, yes, the yogurt I have talked advanced viewer to I would suggest that everyone who is interested to watch your video from the very beginning I have enjoyed every single of them and it's been wonderful yeah yeah from the beginning how did you meet your husband I am just putting in a second vote for it yes I will not talk about it. Do you study French and English at a school or in some formal setting or did you learn them on your own? How do you know how to cook so many things? Maybe I am unduly impressed because recipe or measuring or anything. Okay, uh, where did I study? Where do I study? Did I study English? Uh, in China, all the students start to learn English in any, I think in any education system, second language or, or foreign language is one of the subjects we learn. We are in 24 minutes. So I learned English same as any Chinese kids at the age of 10 and uh, I liked it and uh, I, I, I just enjoyed the, the flashcards and things. So I took exam the, the, so at the very beginning, I remember English is so difficult uh, for, for a person to learn a different language. And uh, I always, this is a book. Is this a book? No, this is not a book. Is that a book? No, that isn't a book. That is a pencil. Something we learn this and it's so difficult to, to pronounce it. And um, so 
So we learned and I made a lot of effort. Our English teacher is a very funny guy and, uh, and, uh, and his pronunciation is not one of the best. And then we have changed another English teacher. He was so good, a charming person, but I just feel he is, because I was, there are many other pretty girls in the class, I feel that I was not favored, and uh, I, I have never been favored anyway, and I was just feeling that it's not fair, fair for, so I dislike this teacher, so I dislike English for some time. And actually, it's, it's just a personal thing, it's a teenager girl thing. And uh, then uh, I start to like it again, and I went to university, Foreign Affairs Institute, and uh, English and uh, International Law is my major. Barbara, you can put a little bit of 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 I learned English and then um, I went to France to learn French. Uh, yeah, because of uh, because of my, my 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 boyfriend at that time. So I went to France. I was uh, how to go to France. Uh, you need to 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 be a student. So. And for that particular moment, I went to student. I signed up for La Sorbonne, La Sorbonne, and I studied French one year. And the teacher speaks only French, no English, no any other languages. And students from all over the world. I have a lot of uh, classmates from Sweden, from uh, Italy, from Argentina, from um, Spain, and. Uh, it's a language course for people all over the world, and um, Chinese, Korean, Japanese, all over the world, Brazil, and uh, it's a it's a full time student, and I signed up for one year, and then the second year, as well as I was continue, we found a job to to America, so we moved to America, so my. English was learned in China. I learned English in China and I learned French in, in France. So before I go to France, I before went to France, I studied French in our university and evening class. It didn't work. Can, can you learn a foreign language on your own? In my opinion, it is not possible. It's impossible to learn a foreign language by your own. You have to have stimulation, you have other things. There are other people more motivated than me. You can learn it by on your own. For me, it's not impossible, impossible to learn a foreign language on my own. And, um, and uh, my English was not good, very not good. And also, I went to uh, I went to France and then not speaking English. And when I first came to Australia, uh, to, 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 to to America, and uh, I I know that my English is very broken. And then we went to Australia. People speak beautiful languages. And we live in Gordon in Sydney. There are a lot of people very, very well educated and who has, has, has a very wonderful choice of words. They articulate very well, so I think uh, uh, not walking, slay, staying in, not walking and, um, and uh, having friends in Australia really improve a lot of my English so that I can slow down. When you walk, when you do business, you have this business vocabulary. When you live a life, the life, the, 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 the language has become so much richness and, uh, and depth. So that's about it. I think we are almost the time, so I will stop here and another video for other questions. I will do another video for other questions.